Good evening. Today I will share with you my story of what happened today. I didn't have a specific plan. I just had to drive north. I wanted to visit a waterfall, but on the way, I saw an intriguing place and I stopped. It has this beautiful gate that allured me. I parked and I walked. It was quite a walk through the forest to arrive at the temple. When I arrived at the temple, there were two dogs. They were both very small. I thought they belonged to one of the visitors, but it turns out that these dogs, two of them, roaming freely around the temple grounds. There is one in particular, the white one, that was friendly to me, allows me to express love. And I wanted to capture it, but I didn't bring 4D. So I took out my phone to record instead. I positioned the phone next to my bag and I went to the same white dog to express my love. But this time, the white dog bit me aggressively on my right pinky. I was surprised to see blood fl flowing out from it. I proceed to wash the wound with a water fountain around the temple square. I decided to walk back to the car. On the way, I saw the blood continues to flow. I arrived and I saw a water fountain and there was a monk collecting water. I arrived there and she saw my wound. I told her that there was two dogs in the temple one of them bit me while I was expressing love. Immediately, she walked towards the shop, which is just 10 meters away from us, went inside, spoke to the shop owner, and both of them came out with a bandage with the antiseptic cream, and she helped me to apply the, the plaster over my wound. And before she let me go, she gave me a pill, anti-inflammatory pill, and she asked me to take it with the water over there where I have just cleaned my wound and met the monk. I was so grateful with their kindness to help me. How a bite from a dog could turn into a beautiful story. <laughs> Coincidentally, I saw two dogs on the road. One is following another. It reminded me of the two dogs that I saw in the temple. And I called that story two friends. <laughs> I find it funny that the lens fucked up. But that's part of the process. So I let it be. <sighs> Thank you for listening.